So, I'm in my 40s, I know, hard to tell, but one of the best years I can remember being a kid was 1982. Everything seemed to happen in 1982. The Commodore 64 came out, as did the Spectrum 48K, Diet Coke was released that year, Nike Air Force Ones came out, they're still around, Channel 4 launched, Knight Rider appeared on the TV. God, I loved Knight Rider, best programme ever. Uh, there were films like Rambo, E.T., Blade Runner, Tron, music-wise Don't Stop Believing came out, uh, Michael Jackson's Thriller album was released, Toto released Africa and Rosanna that year, in one single year, you get the picture, it was just the best year ever. But amongst all those incredible things, a wonderful animated film called The Secret of Neem came out too. Fantasy with wizards and villains. <laughs> And heroes. I ain't scared of nothing. I'd actually read the book in class at school, so I definitely had to go and see it. It turned out to be beautifully made, charming, a great story and adaption from the book. And it also had an unknown Shannon Doherty in it, who I'd develop a massive crush on eight short years later when Beverly Hills 90210 came out. Anyway, digressing. It's the most beautiful sight I've ever seen. The Secret of Neem would probably have been the top children's film of 1982 if it hadn't been up against E.T., and for that reason alone, it deserves so much praise. It had meticulous, hand-drawn animation that was very unique and evocative of that period in time, before the dawning of the Pixar era. And it was made by former Disney animator Don Bluth, shortly after he walked out of Disney, about three years earlier, I think, declaring he was going to recapture the spirit of classical animation that Disney had forgotten about. The characters are just beautifully conceived, drawn and voiced. But more importantly, the film's incredibly potent. It's got a genuine choke-you-up power which will appeal to adults as well as children. It's a classical mice versus men tale mixed alongside uh, devotion to family, love, bravery and set across two intertwining stories. If you've never seen it before, you'll be glad you did. I think The Secret of Neem is a perfect screening for Southampton Film Week. Not only will a new generation of young film watchers be charmed by it, but their mums and dads will also be able to relive a bit of beautiful nostalgia from their younger days, from one of the best years in undoubtedly the best decade in history. <laughs> <laughs>